In this group of videos, we are going to connect different components, including sensors or outputs to our Arduino, and then add just enough code to the Arduino to prove that it's working. This video, we will connect a motion sensor to the Arduino. We will add code to the Arduino that will monitor for motion, and when motion is detected, it will just pass on that data to the monitor. All right now, the nice thing about the motion sensor is it's a, it's a very easy circuit to set up. So on mine, this little thing will pop off, and if you take a look, we've got three connection wires here. And on mine, they're labeled VV, VCC, out, and ground. So we want to connect the ground pin to the ground. We want to connect the five volt pin our out pin and then finally connect the VCC to our digital port and I'm going to put it in number two. So that's the full circuit. Basically now we just need to read from digital port two whether we're getting a one or a zero. Right, for our code, I'm going to create one variable and this is just gonna store which pin our motion sensor is connected to. In our setup, I'm just going to get our serial port set up so we can use the monitor and initialize our pin. So our motion pin, pin number two, is gonna be set up to read input. Next, we will check our motion sensor maybe every, every second. I'm going to create a variable. I'll just call it motion result and set it to read from my pin. And finally, let's output that to our monitor. Right, and if I upload that to my Arduino, and then open up my monitor and stay quite still, we are getting zeros for motion. And now if I wave my hand in front of that motion sensor, we now get a one. Now, if I want to react to that motion, all I need to do is add an if statement and we don't have any LEDs or other outputs attached. So I'm just going to use the built-in LED. So the Arduino circuit board has a built-in LED and I can use that just to show some sort of response to our motion. So I'm gonna initialize the built-in LED and then down below my digital read, I'm gonna check motion result and if it's on or high, I'm gonna take my LED and turn it on.
and if there's no motion, I'm going to turn it off. Oh, sorry, it's not built-in LED, it's LED built-in. I'll get this right eventually. And now if I upload that, and I can open up my monitor again, we can still watch the ones and zeros. And again, if I stay still, we get our zeros. And if I move, notice we get our ones and the LED comes on. So the LED that goes on is right here. I'm gonna put my finger over the other one and stay still. And notice it's off. And now if I move, it's back on.